The Electoral College is the system used in the United States to elect the president and vice president. Rather than a direct popular vote, the president and vice president are elected by a group of electors chosen by each state, equal to the number of its senators and representatives in Congress. The total number of electors in the Electoral College is 538, with 270 electoral votes needed to win the presidency. Here's how the Electoral College impacts presidential elections. State-based allocation. Each state is allocated a certain number of electors based on its representation in Congress. The number of electors for each state is equal to its total number of senators and representatives. For example, California, the most populous state, has 55 electoral votes, while smaller states like Wyoming have only three electoral votes. Winner takes all system, except for Maine and Nebraska, which allocate their electoral votes based on congressional district, most states use a winner-takes-all system. This means that the candidate who wins the popular vote in a state receives all of its electoral votes, regardless of the margin of victory. Importance of swing states. In presidential elections, candidates focus their campaign efforts and resources on swing states, or battleground states, where the outcome is uncertain and the electoral votes are up for grabs. These states often have a history of voting for different political parties and can determine the outcome of the election. Possibility of Electoral College Majority If a candidate receives a majority of electoral votes, 270 or more, they win the presidency. In this case, the popular vote is not decisive in determining the outcome. This has led to situations where a candidate can win the presidency without winning the national popular vote, as seen in the 2000 and 2016 elections. Potential for Electoral College Tie In the event that no candidate receives a majority of electoral votes, the presidential election is decided by the House of Representatives, with each state delegation having one vote. This scenario is rare but possible, and it highlights the unique structure of the Electoral College. Impact on Campaign Strategy The Electoral College system influences campaign strategy with candidates focusing on winning states with the most electoral votes rather than maximizing their national popular vote total. This can lead to situations where candidates prioritize certain states and issues over others to secure victory in the Electoral College. Overall, the Electoral College has a significant impact on presidential elections in the United States, shaping campaign strategy, influencing political outcomes, and occasionally leading to discrepancies between the popular vote and the outcome of the election. While it has been subject to criticism and calls for reform, the Electoral College remains a fundamental aspect of the American electoral process.